and this is actually a game changer when it comes to the P. Diddy indictments and everything of that nature. Let me tell you why. First of all, Dana Tran is a high-ranking cybersecurity official in Malaysia. There are new reports. Sean Diddy Combs is under investigation by a federal grand jury looking at allegations of... ...for Sean Diddy Combs are asking a New York court to throw out portions of a civil suit that accuses the singer of... ...NN and the Los Angeles Times say that the women who are suing Combs for alleged assault will be asked to testify to a grand jury here in New York. Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. One of the greatest name is music scene, Diddy Combs, might be charged by a grand jury. And the most recent development in this tale is that he recently married Dana Tran. Did he start anyone by marrying Dana Tran, the mother of his youngest kid? Only lately, this marriage might lead to treachery and a government problem that could send Diddy company crumbling down. Insider claimed that Diddy may have coerced Dana into the marriage in order to prevent her from testifying against him in court, which is legal for a suppose to do but this isn't a love tale, cannot be forced to testify against their spouse and it appear like Diddy is trying to take advantage of this but Dana isn't going to cap quite despite the dangers she has chosen to reveal Diddy to exposing a few sterling secret this has forced the Department of Justice to act seriously and according to report Diddy's accusers are set to testify before a federal grand jury soon Dana admission may be the last straw for Diddy who has already been included in several civil action most of them are related to La Sol. Kept checking back as we analyze Dana's startling allegation, the FBI probe and the potential ramification for Diddy future. There are new reports. Sean Diddy Combs is under investigation by a federal grand jury looking at allegations of trafficking. In March, Homeland Security officials searched the rap moguls' homes in Miami Beach and Los Angeles. CNN and the Los Angeles Times say that the women who are suing Combs for alleged assault will be asked to testify to a grand jury here in New York. Let's speak about the recent huge marriage news that has everyone talking. A few weeks ago, Diddy shocked everyone by getting married to his mother, Dana Jabber. The youngest kid Diddy has always been jibber for leading a single man's lifestyle and never getting married. So Love Combs followers and insiders were taken aback. However, this jabber just ordinary wedding, everyone was taken by surprise when it happened, so why did they jump into marriage so quickly? Although there is a lot of conjecture, the primary hypothesis relates to Diddy's legal issues. He is the target of many jibber claiming sexual assault, and his legal team may be employing marriage as a tactic. He may have been attempting to use the spousal privilege, a legal protection that allows Dana to testify against him in court to his advantage. By Jabber Dana, many cases, but not only Jabber ones in spite of her worries that Diddy would take revenge, Dana Tran has spoken out about her experiences and alleges that he forced her to marry him. To prevent her from testifying about her allegations against him, provide information on his claimed abusive actions and his use of Jibber to manipulate people, particularly women. One of Dana's most compelling allegations is that Diddy has engaged in repeated acts of sexual misconduct, which is consistent with the jabber made in the cases filed against him. Her jibber statement might inspire others to come out and share similar experiences, which could complicate matters further for Diddy Papaya. If Dana's jibber are validated, they may be used as vital evidence in the current Diddy investigation, which would have major repercussions for him legally. Perhaps even grand jury jibber as this narrative develops, it's evident that the Department of Justice is treating these accusations seriously and developing a case. The Dana Jibber disclosures have given an already difficult situation a new dimension. Her bravery in speaking forward in spite of the dangers demonstrates how serious the accusations are. Things with Diddy just will not get any better. Alright, so as you all know, this is P. Diddy. But this right here, this is Dana Tran, alright? Dana is the mother to his most recent daughter, Love. So allegedly, a lot of sources are speculating that P. Diddy and Dana Tran ended up getting married a few days ago and they did this in hawaii and, and this is actually a game changer when it comes to the p diddy indictments and everything of that nature let me tell you why first of all dana tran is a high-ranking cybersecurity official in malaysia so she definitely know how to work with the cybersecurity situations 
So it is alleged that she actually helped Diddy spy on Kim Porter by putting cameras in her home and helping him tap her phone. This is all alleged. If you are not familiar with who Kim Porter is, Kim Porter is P. Diddy's ex. She is the mother of a few of P. Diddy's children and she passed away in the the entire situation of Kim Porter's passing was very suspect and suspicious. Okay, let's discuss the charge and federal probe that might seriously ruin Diddy Life This Claims are being investigated by the Department of Justice, considering Dana Trent's startling feeding the police are working harder to hold Diddy responsible. They are conducting a covert probe, gathering information and speaking with Winters to create a complaint case the activities of the Department of Justice demonstrate how grave the situation is which federal prosecutors working around the clock subpoenas are being issued as they totally examine every aspect of DD accusation leaving no stone unturned in their pursuit of justice creating emails and conducting in-depth interviews with DD acquaintances. The grand jury is a major player in this prop. The grand jury has a significant say in the outcome. Unlike an ordinary jury which considered the evidence given by the prosecution to determine guilt or innocence in the event that there is sufficient evidence to formally prosecute the grand jury swear to maintain the confidently of the processing while they consider whether to file charges this is all done in private the grand jury's involvement indicates that the case is act and career point if the grand jury greater sufficient evidence did he may face charges and go to trial which would be a significant turn is this legal deport and might have a significant effect on his personal and professional life should the grand jury decide to indicate him it indicates that the persecution has a solid case and a significant high profile trial may ensure however did he has been in trouble before he has been the treasure of travel equation and court cases through the year the legal cases that accuse him of our as well are among the most damaging since they present a negative image of did women have come out with horrific account of abuse claiming did he use his status to intimate it and take adventure of them implying that he is a predator previous accusation concurrent Kim Porter did the ex-partner and the mother the three of his children prior to his pacing portrait intended to publish a book on her problematic marriage to Diddy also she never disclosed it there have always been rumors that she had harmful information regarding Diddy action Erica Candy a journalist was also investigating Getting Diddy ties to problems pure to her ultimately that this earlier instance highlight how serious the current accusation are and demonstrate how Diddy behavior has always been an issue. The assortment of civil litigation. This earlier issue highlight the significance of the government inquiry by highlighting the gravity of the allegation and and the potential difficulty for Sean Diddy Diddy Combs are asking in. a New York court to throw out portions of a civil suit that accuses the singer of assault and revenge. The motion filed Friday raises procedural issues with a suit filed last year by Joy Dickerson Neal. She is claiming that Combs drugged her, then assaulted her while she was a college student back in 1991. Dickerson Neal appeared in a music video with Combs around that same time, but Combs is denying that this happened, saying that she's simply trying to get money from him. I wish for the sake of Kim's family, because bruh, if you know what I know, he put Kim in a gold casket, casket. Then has security 
24 hour security at the funeral home so nobody would go in there and touch the casket or take him out of there. I believe I think that they should reopen our case and have an independent pathologist look at everything about her so she can rest in peace. The testimony of witnesses, including former friends, co-workers, and insiders, is one of the most gibber aspects of the federal inquiry and might provide crucial information against Diddy. One potential witness who is a Capricorn Diddy's ointment gibber Capricorn has previously confirmed some of Dana Trans's claims and spoken up against Diddy's aggressive behavior. Her comments lend credence to the allegations and may play a significant role in the inquiry. Other jabber have also indicated that they are eager to come forward. These individuals have worked closely with Diddy and are able to provide first-hand gibber of his actions. Their testimony may also reveal behavioral trends, support the claims, and provide light on Diddy's gibber of manipulating and controlling individuals. The willingness of these individuals to testify indicates that Diddy is under increasing pressure and that there is a greater chance that he will suffer grave repercussions. Uh, so I don't think we talked about it. I just spoke about it with Donnie. But I see the intern for Diddy, actually. In 2014, uh, when I was in college in Florida, he had the revolts um, conference that happened in Miami every year. Mm. And the first two years I was an intern. So I worked for Revolt and here and there we would see him, but we would hear him mostly because he did just like those viral videos of him, like going crazy, throwing the phone. So like he would, he's like that in real life, you mm. know? So from my peers and just from what I witnessed, I saw like hostile situations, but they kind of chalked it up to that's just the business. You know, that's, that's the industry. If you want to work for Diddy, you got to, go walk and get cheesecake or go, yeah. you know, yeah. go do the things he asked you to do. So even though we heard rumblings of it, but no real evidence, like concrete evidence, it was like, okay, it's probably a conspiracy theory. Then when, especially when the video came out yeah. with Cassie, that was the, yeah, he did. Diddy's sudden marriage to Dana Tren has left many fans stunned and has sparked discussions regarding freedom gibber. Some people think that the union was an attempt to utilize the gibber privilege, which may prohibit Dana from testifying against him in court. Fans who are aware of Diddy's prior legal ploys have taken to this hypothesis, with one Twitter user writing, Instagram users have been sharing their opinions and conjectures under the hashtag gibber drama. One widely shared post asks whether these claims are genuine. Nobody should be above the law and Diddy needs to be held jabber. Meanwhile, hundreds of comments have been made on a Reddit post devoted to the case. There is a general public interest in the case, as seen by the social jabber buzz created by individuals disputing Dana's statements and the possible results. In addition to being drawn to the sensational revelations, many users are supporting Dana Tran and praising her bravery, raising concerns about the consequences for justice and jibber. What do you guys think of Diddy's choice to come clean about his alleged wrongdoings? Do you think that Jabber and Dana Tran's marriage was a covert maneuver to stay out of problems with the law? Please feel free to jibber your thoughts in the comments section below. If you liked the video and would like to get updates on celebrity news in the future, please subscribe and click the notification bell.